What's going on everybody, busy back with another indie project game thing. This time around it's called Nocturnal Visit. Uh, apparently this is a reported haunted house and we're a blogger and we've decided to go and do our own investigation to find out if the rumours are true. So uh, without further ado, let's get into it, shall we? I am ready to leave. Oh, fantastic. Oh, that's right, it's like a PSX kind of deal. Oh, okay. When the crosshair turns red, you can interact by pressing E. Oh, look at that little tutorial. Noise. I have to clean my room. Yeah, well, can't we, like, do that right now, jeez? Is that supposed to be, like, a very unrendered Pringles container? Oh. Just a bunch of random boxes. Nothing of special interest. I should check my laptop for I applied to do that. But oh, okay, so I have to be right next to it. Um Did I crash it? Hello. I crushed the game. Nope, we're back. Okay, that was weird. But who knows what just happened? Ah, uh, it's annoying that it's very silent right now. Spookiest haunted house. This is no normal house. Its backstory even helps to add to the spookiness. Built in the 60s, this house was home for several serial killers. Mm, fantastic. Nowadays, all that's left is the remains of the lives that were taken in this place. But why is it still a mystery? Numerous reports of disappearances have been made after some people had visited this house. We do not recommend to explore this house by any means. It's not safe, and you might not return from it. Well, let's go visit this house. This ought to be fun. <laughs> I hated the warnings that I left. Uh, let, let's get back into this. Can't believe if I just went back into the car and I was in. All right, let's explore this spookiness. Press F to turn on your flashlight. Lovely. Oh, it's the gate that was in the tutorial. Hello. Are you actually haunted? Investigate the trash, that's all it's in. No one in the windows? No? Are you good? It's locked. I'll look for another way. Oh yeah, is there an open window around? Follow this path. Oh, back gate. It was a bug. It was a bug. Hello. In about a home. It's a dark void. So I guess there's a cut here. Render in the house, please. Hello. In about a home. Ooh, the bathroom, it's always the safest place to look. Give a good flush. Break a mirror, as always, you don't want that. Can I turn this on? Damn it. Is there anybody here? Oh, I don't want to fall down there. 
Ooh. Newspaper. Pot. Doesn't seem out of all that, gentlemen. No. It's been there for a while. Kitchen. Is that me walking or is that someone else walking? Do, 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 do. Some leftovers. But how old are those leftovers? Still good. Dripping tap. Nothing of interest in here, really. No. Can I open up all the cupboards? No, there's only select ones. We'll um, we won't talk about those plates. So far, it's been nothing. But I guess we're gonna go upstairs and find out. Oh wait, let's. Ah, so that's why the front door is barred. Nope, upstairs it is. Do do do. Hello. I heard you knocking. The we'll investigate that in a second. Okay, locked. Well, that was cheap. It's an old house. Okay, it's falling apart. That's the explanation. It's not haunted. No, no dial tone, of course. Somehow it's still powered. Ooh, a bedroom. No, can't do anything here, no. I can walk on top of the bed, fantastic. I guess we go into the attic where everything happens. Now I swear, if there's a Ouija board up here... Hello? Oh, there's a key to that lock room, I'm guessing. Oh, it's a garage key, lovely. How is there power up here when there's no power to the house? There's no cord through oh, okay now I'm getting weirded out. Is that a tip face down to be fantastic? Fax machine. This place is weird. Do 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 So we're going to go downstairs again to find that garage. Garage. Is this it? Hello? I'm guessing this is the thing that fell. <clears throat> well, this is very, very quiet, people. There's no ambient sound at all. Oh, lovely. The basement key. I have like a weapon in case there's actually like someone living in here or something. Hello! Well that's just fantastic. Um... Excuse me? Why does it have to be the room that I have to go into now? I'm coming down! That lock behind me, I'm guessing. Hey! Someone left the flashlight. Update, 1.43am. The house just seems abandoned. Overall, nothing has happened. 1.51. About 10 minutes in, and I'm starting to feel a bit overwhelmed. I really don't like the environment in this place. I've heard several weird noises, and I feel like I'm being watched. Okay, hold on. 202. Getting in this place was a complete mistake. Something is definitely stalking me, but I can't see it. Oh, 205 am. The door is locked, and I've got no way of getting out. I'm screwed. Five, something is coming to the basement. Lovely. Phone upstairs is ringing, but I can't get out of here. Am I able to leave? Oh, I can. Hello? Wait, where was the telephone? Was it upstairs? It was, wasn't it? Upstairs. Hello. Hello. 
Yes. Somebody help me. Well, that didn't help me at all. Can I enter the... The back door just opened. I can hope it did. Hello? What, am I going to be like trapped in the basement now? Oh, I didn't even say I had an ending. Okay, so that's that, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> that scare at the end could have been better if it was more of a sudden sound and a small build up. Or just like a quick turn. But all in all, it was very. How do I. It would have been better if there was some more ambient sound within the house, not just dead silence. But all in all, it was a fun experience. I, <laughs> I can't believe I got the good ending immediately just by getting the car and fucking gapping. But anyway, if you enjoyed that, give it a like, subscribe for more, and uh, I should hopefully be doing more of these in the near future. So uh, with that, if you did like, uh, give this. If you did enjoy this video, give it a like, subscribe for some more, and uh, I shall catch you in the next one. See you then.